Well, hello guys, Girl Got Game. Welcome back to XOXO Droplets. Today we're doing Ralph, the jock click member boyfriend. So with Ralph, um, in order to get him as your boyfriend, you need to unlock five date locations in one playthrough. And then when, and also, um, man, why are these words not coming to my mind? Uh, <laughs> you also have to get max affection with him, obviously. I'm finding grinding out his, um, like unlocking Ralph as a boyfriend is a lot easier than it, um, Jason's was, so that's kind of nice. But anyway, we're back at the type game, so I thought I'd bring you in so we can get an idea of what Ralph might be like. And I have my trusty notes here since I have no idea. So apparently Ralph is also extroverted. Extroverted. That way he'd have the same disposition as me. Why does that matter? Because I'm great, so being like me is always a good thing. <laughs> Alright, and that's it for the personality portion of our questions. Wow, you weren't kidding. How short is this quiz? There are nine questions. Really? Not even ten? I could make it one more if you wanted me to. That's all right. Just bring on question two already. Okay. Question two. In comparison to you, what's your preference for height? Taller, shorter, about the same. Okay, Ralph is taller. Taller, please. What a predictable answer. <laughs> Whatever. I like what I like. Great. Question three, what's your preferred body type out of the people here? Kinda scrawny, sorta of fit, or more muscular? Well, Ralph is a jock, so he's muscular. A six pack, please. Don't make this more awkward than it already is. Sorry, just being honest. Mm-hmm. Question four, how do you feel about the length of their hair? Long, really short, at least a little something that hangs down. Uh, Ralph has short hair. Super short. Just like yours, huh? <laughs> I never said short was only attractive on guys. Good point. Alright, question five. Do you have any preference for skin tone? Lighter colored, medium, especially dark. Um, you don't have to answer if you don't want to, Jerkit. Uh, let's see. Ralph is medium-toned. Nah, I don't mind sharing. Right around the middle works best for me. Okay. Question six. Uh, I don't know if this question will really work. What's the problem? It's about the outfits people are wearing, but, you know, uniforms. Can't you tweak it? Sure. Everybody will just have to think about the types of clothes we wear outside of school, though. I'm sure we'll manage. Got it. Question six. When it comes to clothes, what types of color schemes do you prefer? Light and saturated colors, dark and muted colors, a mix of both. Uh, let's see. A mix of both is what Ralph wears. There are times and places for both. Right. You shouldn't have to limit yourself to just one type. Mm-hmm. Question seven. Do you care about the way their eyebrows look? This is getting ridiculous. Sorry, there are only so many questions you can ask about this kind of thing. Who cares? It's almost over. Let them ask the dumb questions. Ahem. <laughs> As I was saying, is there something you prefer when it comes to eyebrows? Really thin, average, extra thick. Oh, Ralph's got them thick eyebrows. Nice and thick. You're seriously starting to make this uncomfortable. That was inevitable. My dear Nate. <laughs> Alright. Question 8. Glasses. Yay or nay? A nay. Peeper time. Nay, give me a clear view of those peepers. Don't call them that. I'll do what I want. 
Question 9. The last question. Finally. You do remember that after her, we're all going to have to take a turn, right? I know, but this part is almost over and that's something. Hardly, but whatever makes you happy, sweet pea. Shh! Give me the last question, Shiloh. We're so close to the results. Uh, maybe we should skip it. Uh, what's the problem? The last question is unfair. It's about piercings, and SSB doesn't allow piercings for guys. There's only ever been one exception, so we couldn't know if the results were really right. Fine, let's ask. Is there anyone here who would have a piercing if you were allowed to have one? Me. I pierced my ears, or at least one. Anyone else? Ah, uh, I would. Jeremy, you'd have a piercing. Yes. Wow, what would you pierce? My belly button. Oh my god, I could have gone my whole life without knowing that. <laughs> and there you go. We'll just use our imaginations to pretend we live in a world where Everett has his ears pierced and Jeremy also has something pierced. That'll work. And once again, it is a nay. Mm, no thanks. If you didn't want the guy to have a piercing anyways, then why didn't you say so? We could have skipped trying to figure out who hypothetically would have had one. Sorry, I was curious. <sighs> Alrighty, let's hear who my best match is. None of us. Excuse me? Yeah, your answers don't really fit with one specific guy. Ah, so I don't get a pick? This is the worst game ever. Calm down. If you want the best guy for you, just look at them. I'm sure you can figure it out yourself from there. Worst game ever. Fine. You want a pick, you can have Ralph. The football player? Mm, yes, he works. Oh, okay then. <laughs> I'm happy again. Really? You're fine with that? Yep. Thinking about it, he really does match a lot of my answers. Uh, whatever. Are we finished? We just got started. It's alright. This game isn't fun with this group. We don't have to keep playing. Great. Is the meeting over? Chyla gives up so easily with these, uh, <laughs> click boyfriends. No, not yet. Then what are we supposed to do now? Okay, well that was a little bit different there. Um, let me just get you guys to the weekend. Oh, I should have actually switched that answer. Oh, well. Um, so as you can see, it's January 31st, and my, 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 my missy. So we're at 490. Got a little bit more to go before we max him out. And I'll bring you in just so you guys can see that I did accept him as my boyfriend. We can read his boyfriend card. Uh, but other than that, things are going pretty swimmingly, actually. Um, I use the cheat code to give myself... Um, is affection the right word? Points, I guess. Points works. Uh, I got points with all the clicks, so I don't have to worry about that. And I do have an arsenal of Swifty Taffies ready and waiting for me once I'm done. Um, leveling up affection with Ralph. Right now I've got blue gifts that are on weekly equip uh, to get Ralph's affection up to maximum. So, yeah, I'm just working and um, for Ralph. I don't know if I mentioned it for Jason. Jason works um, here at the daycare, the second one, um, on Sundays. And Ralph uh, works... So, yeah, Ralph works at the bakery number two on Saturdays. So that's what I've been doing to get my affection up with him. But that's the only updates I got for now, guys. So when something else happens, I'll bring you in. 
All right, it's April 4th, and we've maxed out affection with Ralph. Huzzah! So let's make him our official boyfriend. All date locations are now unlocked. Great. Forever. So here's Ralph. <laughs> Ralph C. He's in the jocks click. Uh, his enemies are the populars. Which is ironic, because that was the last click we just did. He likes football, board games, and cooking. Football and board games don't often go hand in hand, but that's nice. And I like a guy who can cook. But he just likes tomatoes, dessert, perfume, and watching movies. In fact, all date locations will immediately be unlocked. I don't think I've ever met someone who dislikes watching movies. That's really interesting. So, same Odelia. Yeah, we can just, like, go out forever. Alright, well... Good to know. Okay, so we've got Ralph as our boyfriend. So unless, uh, unless, good grief, I really can't speak today. Unless, uh, unless, uh, <laughs> whatever, this is a mess. Unless something actually happens with one of the other guys with a random scene or something, we'll just be going to the end of all things. But we might get some more random scenes, so if we do, I'll bring you in, guys. All right, things were pretty quiet this time around, so no extra scenes. Uh, and we got here at the end of the school year, and it's time to say goodbye to people. Shouldn't be as many to say goodbye to this time around. First of all, we have Arthur. Ah, uh, what am I supposed to do now? Finish the week? That's all you can do. Okay, now we'll make sure we don't skip too fast and furiously through this again, just in case. Because I can't remember for sure if we've said goodbye to uh, Ralph before. We might have. Okay. Alright. I'm just finishing up the last meeting. Come on, let's skip, 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 skip. Heart y'all too. Goodbye. <laughs> Fina, Fena, miss you. I know. Betty. Hey, chump. I'll be seeing you. Thanks, Betty. Did Ralph really not say goodbye to us? Really? That is so funny. <laughs> hmm. Okay, today's the day. Yeah, who needs Ralph? He won't even say goodbye to you. <laughs> I even made doubly sure. My sisters don't want to see me. Well, at least Jason had the decency to say goodbye to me my final week here at school. Ralph was like, yeah, see you around. <laughs> not, not even see you around, just, I don't even know who you are. I'm shooketh. <laughs> that is really, really funny. Okay, well, heck you, Ralph, I guess. <laughs> Jocks. Ugh. <laughs> they don't care about nothing but their football. Anyway, that was Ralph's route. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed what little there was to see of it. Um, and the next time, let me look at my notes. Oh, it's Rex from the Troublemaker Clan. And actually, we've seen Rex before in XOXO Blood Droplets. So I actually know what he does look like. That'll be a little bit of change of pace. If you're interested in seeing what that has entailed for us, at least as far as the type scene um, goes, then I hope I'll see you over there, guys. Until then, I will see you later.